guys, we are here at Walker Bay. Stefano, Stefano, Stefano. Tell me about this Walker Bay. I uh, I really like the look of this. Can you give me a rundown? Stefano, uh, by the way, guys, makes uh, he he helps design these boats. So I go straight to the top. I don't I don't I don't I don't go ahead and 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 talk to people who are not going to help me get what I want. So tell yeah. me about this bad boy. So I love this boat. I spent a lot of time in this boat uh, and was very involved in the design on it. And what we wanted about uh, in this boat is something that not only looks great, looks exciting, but it's fun and exciting to drive. Okay, so um, so when you're sitting here on the back seat, you got a big, powerful rear end. Uh, can take a big motor. Um, you're, you're recessed down here in a nice driver's seat. Uh, it's dry, built to drive fast, and but be comfortable when you're driving fast. But it's got a nice flip up bolster in case the, the seat gets a bit heavy and you want to stand up. But uh, really, my favorite position is driving like a sports car when I'm deep down in the boat and so it's still very stable while you're in there. Yeah, extremely stable. Uh, we wanted to make the boarding really easy on this boat, so you can hop in either side. Big boarding steps on both sides, and okay? that allows you to hop in and out. You got enough room for three people to sit on the back here. Loads of storage inside in case you want to go on adventures. We even had one customer call us his expedition tender, uh -huh. tender because uh, you know they can put so much stuff in it for the size, it's so uh, robust and seaworthy uh, that they could just go as far as they wanted and spend the whole day going out, crossing big bays and going on all sorts of adventures. Um, but uh, comfort for your friends and your family that are in the boat today. So you got a nice seat here in front of the console. You have a nice seat over there so you can have at least four adults comfortably sitting facing. And this here removes up. Got so a removable sunbed here, so if you want to lounge around, that's great. But if you want to have more gear, again, you can store that in there. There's insulated coolers, okay? They're not just buckets that you can put ice in. They're actually insulated coolers, so your ice will stay frozen. And I've found sometimes, actually, I've been in tropical climates, I've been in a bucket of a bag of ice um, in uh, the afternoon, and I come back and the ice is still there the following morning. Okay? That's in the tropics. Um, yeah, another great feature is getting on and off the boat. That easy post in the back actually works as a handrail, so you want to be easy getting in and out. That's good. Expe uh, especially people that are older, that's a big thing for them. It's a big deal. Big a deal. big, big thing because, yeah. you know, that, that'll ruin someone's day. If you yeah. you have something you can get on and off real, real no. easily. Yeah. And, and you said, is that is that something that could come on and off if you wanted it? Yeah, so it's removable. You can take it in or out. Oh, that's uh, good. Depending on when you need it or if you just want more space. Uh, having the gunnel up front here actually makes you feel like you're sitting in shelter and protected in the boat, which is a great feature on this. It's beamy, so you can actually have, you know, proper space, proper width seats, so you're actually comfortable sitting in this thing and not feeling like you're sitting, you know, in the back of economy class where you can't tilt your seat back. I, I, I like the handrails because that, that obviously, when, you, when you're yeah. inflatable, you have something hard that you can hold on to. It makes yeah. you feel really safe. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so tell well, me about the, the design. Hull. Yeah, the, the, the this thing is great. It's um, uh, it's it's a pretty complicated hull uh, because you have a, a modified bee. So up, up front, you you know you have a nice sharp bow that cuts through waves. It also keeps spray down and stuff like that. As you get to the back, it gets a little bit more stable. But um, there's a lot of stuff that goes on inside this boat, which is the the construction. So we have what we call our spider stringer system, which is a polyurethane um, uh, foam uh, uh, composite. Um, in a stringer system and the deck and the hull and that stringer system are all bonded together. So when this thing goes through chop, it pounds into waves, not only does it absorb the chop, it just hammers through it. Nice. Okay, so it helps you make it through that. Uh, and what can you, what, what, what up to what rating is this? Uh, this one power? takes up to a 115. A 115. And you yeah. guys have this far? Uh, and it'll do, uh, it, it'll pretty comfortably do uh, 40 knots. 40 knots with a, yeah, with a 115. Yeah. Wow, yeah. That's, that's nice. I usually have, I think, a 17 pitch of off on. You also have a stair, uh, a ladder back here. Yep, a nice ladder with some comfortable steps getting on and off, and handrails so you can climb in and out. Uh, there's a shower, a freshwater shower, it makes it rinse off. Right here is a freshwater shower right in here. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah, good. It's a nice heavy duty uh, telescoping ski pole here. Um, really solid, stylish, and flush. Here's where you would put some water. Light pole, the water goes there. 
and monster storage. You know, it be going like this, you have lots of room for storage inside. Another great feature on this is a yacht tender is lifting points. Okay, so this has a bunch of lifting points, and a lot of yachts have different requirements. So this has lifting points in the back, there's lifting points here, there's lifting points here, and it has lifting points here. But those lifting points also do something else. So those lifting points are actually a mechanical bond between the stringer system and the hull and the deck. So the hull and the deck, not only are they bonded together with, with adhesives and the stringer system, but um, they have all of these lifting points, which you can see are heavy duty, heavy gauge stainless steel. Those are actually bolting through uh, sections that actually go into the hull. So the whole thing is just rock solid. So when you're driving fast through heavy seas, it just feels like a... All right, you know, so I'm sold. Where do I go get one? Uh, when can I see trial one? Tell me, tell me. Where do so, I get them? So, so you can see trial at uh, your... Uh, uh, at the Miami Boat Show um, and uh, you know we have dealers that you can find on our website so depending on where you are in the world because we have dealers worldwide you can find a dealer uh, with excellent service nearby you that'll take care of you. Stefano definitely I'm gonna take you up on the offer of the sea trial. Thank I, you. I, I got a shake on it. Yeah. Thanks All right guys here. thank you. Yeah.